All right, uh, impacted investing at work there. Um, uh, our, our, our last presenter, uh, last but certainly not least, um, is the uh, Gratitude Network. And as we mentioned in, in this morning's uh, plenary, the Gratitude Network and SOCAP have partnered this year on the Gratitude Awards at SOCAP. The awards recognize the most promising and innovative early stage social ventures in education, health, and in community development. I'd like to introduce Randy Haken and Paul Miller from the Gratitude Network. Thank you, Phil. <laughs> all right, the moment we've all been waiting for, for the Gratitude Awards. Perhaps? There we go. Uh, just a couple words for those of you that weren't here in the morning. Uh, we, we actually started with 500 applications that came in to SOCAP for scholarships. And those were narrowed down. Uh, some of the focus of the awards were that we were obviously looking for incredible young entrepreneurs. Nonprofit and for-profit were both included and tend to be early stage with some traction already. We had 32 semifinalists and we had a wonderful panel of judges that went through those and came up with our nine finalists. And I wanted to ask our nine finalists to stand up so we can recognize all nine of them together. So, one of the things that uh, we want to take a moment to do is to just to, in thanking you, to let you know that Salesforce, Google, Adobe, and Wenty Vineyards have, are all providing gifts to all nine of you. So you will be picking up something. Um, and uh, Salesforce in particular, the desk.com product, they're, they're going to be supporting your team. It's a pretty exciting uh, CRM product that is designed for startups. Uh, Google has given each of you two Chromebooks for your companies. Adobe is providing creative. So you've got the whole suite of products for multiple people in the company to use if you're creative. <laughs> and Wenty Vineyards actually has a label called the Art of Giving. And we'll, we'll show you that in just a second. You can see a little hint behind me. But a, a wonderful fit with the theme of, of our uh, event here for the last few days. Um, one of the things that we'll be doing with uh, the four winners is uh, working as hard as we can over the next year to gain them ex exposure uh, to this community and to other communities. The Gratitude Network will be making a lot of connections and deep mentoring. And an example of the deep mentoring is we're going to be matching each of the four winners up with these four individuals uh, who are just wonderful uh, and incredible mentors here, and uh, we hope that you'll get a lot out of that. In addition, you'll have a team that will work with you throughout the year in getting you to the next stage. So, let me turn things over to Paul to do the honors. Great. Thank you, Randy. Thank you, Phil. Um, again, we're very humbled and honored to be on the SOCAP stage to present the Gratitude Awards, and as many of you saw this morning, uh, these are nine finalists. They are all winners in our minds. Uh, very, very difficult decisions to decide on these nine excellent startup companies. Um, but without further ado, let's, let's go on to present the Health and Wellness Award. And this goes to Drinkwell. You could come up on stage. Congratulations. And uh, just in case you need more to carry. <laughs> you got a picture? There you go. Thank you. Drinkwell is providing innovative solutions to purifying the arsenic uh, poisoning problem around the world. In the next category of education, this one also is very fundamental to everything we do here at SOCAP. And the winner is Springboard. <laughs> I'm 
Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Just uh, stand there and we'll... Yes, the uh, last category we have is community development, and this one really ties in with the entire theme of igniting vibrant communities here at SOCAP. Again, uh, three very excellent uh, finalists were in this category. And the winner, LaborLink. There you go. And as we mentioned this morning, the uh, final award is really chosen by you, the audience, uh, the people's choice. And people voted online during the day after talking to the entrepreneurs and hearing their fast pitch this morning. So thank you. <laughs> so the audience choice winner is Jail Education Solutions. <laughs> Picture, uh, why don't we get a picture of all the, all the um, folks here quickly? And then we wanted to do one last thank you. Okay, I want to just take a moment to um, ask Kevin Jones to come on up here and, and thank him. These guys have been wonderful partners for us. And uh, having, and Rosalie. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Look at all these. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, we just wanted to, we wanted to say, um, it, just in the spirit, uh, having come here the last four years and been part of this, yeah. and the ability to recognize folks like this has just been wonderful, and thank you so much for thank, making thank that for possible. Thank, thank you. you. Thank yeah. you. And we have something for you as well. Uh -huh. You get one. You get one. <laughs> Party. <laughs> now. Yeah. Yeah. The idea here is that that should be enough for two rounds for the whole team. Absolutely. So, Absolutely. Yeah. Thank you all very much. Thank you.